côté de ma famille, euh, du côté de ma mère, il y a un côté anglophone. Elle, elle est pas anglophone, mais sa mère est anglophone. Fait que ça explique peut-être euh, mon prénom. Montréal. Cultural life is really vibrant and diverse. Four seasons, which, uh, by the way, the summer is really nice here. Simple. I like it simple. Johann Sebastian Bach. Mozart. <laughs> Who else? Maybe Schubert. <laughs> the fact that uh, I always discover new things and learn new things. Music uh, makes us learn different things, not just music, but history, how people function, psychology, cognitive things, science. The fact that my career is diverse, so I, I do many things. A little bit, maybe 15, 20 minutes, but uh, I, I'm not good at that. So that's why I, I need to bring uh, movies or I watch movies from the airplane. I really like brunch. I like eating in general, but uh, basically eggs, toast, that's like, I, it has to be there. Like, you cannot like, so that's very important and probably uh, pancakes. probably my soon-to-be-born baby. <laughs> Somebody should answer that, not me. I would hope that honesty is in there, a certain form of openness, I hope. Morning now, but uh, that's a new development uh, since probably five years, four or five years. And uh, before, before it was completely the other way around. I mean, not a night person, never been, but uh, morning were really bad and evening was good, but now it's changed since four or five years. Rome, 2000 years ago. Israel, about uh, 15 years ago. It was a tour with my trio back then. It was really good musically, but it's about uh, the traveling and the sightseeing, it's unbelievable. I guess uh, if I could like learn faster everything. Imagine you could like uh, learn to be a, a, a doctor in like, look, let's not exaggerate, but in two months, let's say, can you imagine? To be able to, to do construction, I don't know, uh, do renovation and not have to, to hire somebody and I do it myself at my own rhythm with my own concept of what I want to do. Uh, that would be amazing. <laughs> My accent, yeah. Maybe the elephant. I just love them. And they're so fascinating. The meatloaf. We don't know what's going to happen after. Nobody. But... M me, I would say to them, and that's what I say to my students even at, at the university, is that like, uh, I believed somehow that there's going to be unseen opportunities after that for in different kind of areas in music, because I think it might have more space in a way, because a lot of people are maybe dropping out or trying to do different things because it's been so difficult. And I would say to them to to not give up and to even put more energy to be ready for those opportunities because I believe they will come.